What's good, my people? What's good? Straight Rebel coming back at you with another video, man. Coming back with another video, another reaction. Hope everybody's doing good this Sunday. Hope everybody getting ready to light off them fireworks tomorrow. If y'all, if you know, if y'all town, if y'all city, letting y'all do that, because you know, sometimes, I don't know, right now it's getting crazy. Everybody's city and town is not letting them do certain stuff and letting them fire off certain fireworks, saying certain shit is illegal. They even shutting shit down here in Phoenix, like literally, like shutting people shit down and just taking their stuff or pulling stings, going in there and checking them out and seeing if, if, if they stuff is okay to sell going in there and, and pulling the rest of people or taking all that stuff so hopefully y'all's able to turn up like y'all want tomorrow and tonight hopefully but no further ado let's get into this reaction real quick let's check this one out officers are on scene because of a 911 call that has come in of a woman who is bleeding badly after being stabbed by a man that then there was multiple other 911 calls about uh, of his location Officers are finding that guy now. We do have audio. Let's listen in. Hey, get down on the ground. Get your hands out of your pocket. Drop it. Stop. Stop. Shoot the knife. Shoot the knife. Second officer on scene shows up here. More audio. That unit just stay right there. determined that this guy was unresponsive they are going to approach him kick the the knives away from him he's actually found with a pair of scissors and a knife on him they started life-saving measures uh, unfortunately they proved unsuccessful and this dude shuffled off this mortal coil part of his knife was actually found in what happened with what happened with fucking tasers people what happened with tasers because the first cop that pulled up that nigga was way than more within enough feet to use his taser. He didn't have to shoot no gun. The, that guy was, that was not even coming after him. That nigga was literally coming down around that wall. And literally, like, what the? That's that's insane. Like, they could have easily, like, just tasered him. They could have tasered him. Why didn't they taser him? Why they, why they have to shoot? They had a good enough distance. And I've seen plenty of times where they will tase a motherfucker before they actually before they actually shoot him like what what's going on and then y'all sitting there saying throw the knife away throw the knife away obviously the nigga didn't throw the knife away because he was fucking dead he's unresponsive like it, sh it won't take a motherfucker that long to throw a knife away if you are if you already got shot multiple times it showed him they showed him even fall over like, I understand, like, he did some other stabbing and some shit like that, but that don't mean you pull up guns blazing. You got a taser. Use it. These motherfuckers, not all these motherfuckers in the world can withstand a taser. Literally. Come on, like, seriously. His victim, she had serious injuries, but is expected to survive, and we're going to think about lessons. Hey, everyone's not too late to sign up and join us. That's, that's, that's so much. That's that's ridiculous. Like, I don't I don't get these cops. I I don't get these cops nowadays. Like, why do y'all have to pull up so aggressive, so so quick, fire guns blazing? It's called a taser. Why can't why can't we use it? Why can't we use it like that? So stuff like that just makes me like uh, it's like people got a brain. Y'all you, y'all you know, supposed to be cops. Y'all supposed to be the first ones on the scene, but think the smartest. You got a taser. Use it. Come on, people. But that's that's it for this reaction, man. Hope y'all enjoyed this one. 
got some more coming later on too as well. Enjoy y'all Sunday, man.